Hello, my name is John, and today we're in the cockpit of the HAS 37 Wigan again. In this video, we're going to take a look at the RB05A air to ground missile. Now, the RB05A is quite a different piece to all the other missiles currently simulated in DCS, as, as it is for many other weapons of the Wigan. And uh, because the RB05A is command guided, this means uh, once you fire the weapon, you have to use a small joystick to guide the weapon onto target and uh, it has a bright signal flare on the back and is extra smokeless so that you can actually see where the missile is going and uh, this makes it quite difficult because you have to A. fly the aircraft so it doesn't collide into the ground or doesn't get shot down and B. you have to guide the missile onto target and uh, that can be quite difficult I mean it's, it's not so difficult to hit a warehouse but uh, hitting like a single tank or a single unit like that um, would be quite difficult or is quite difficult um, and just to give you some perspective in the real Wigan uh, training a uh, Wigan pilot has to fire 1000 missiles in the simulator until he's allowed in the aircraft to try a cheaper and slower version of the RB05 first and only once he managed that as well he's allowed to, uh, to fire one real RB05A because it's just that difficult to actually guide it and judge where it is because it's very hard to see uh, the altitude and this, uh, the direction the missile is going and all that but we will take a look at that uh, how that works in a second now first let me unpause uh, this mission here and uh, enable the altitude hold so we can set up everything how we need it now um, here we want to go into the, the master mode we set to A and F or attack mode and on the weapon selector we go in, in the attack mode as well uh, the first waypoint, the B1 waypoint is this small island up ahead there uh, we have set it up as a navigation waypoint and our target is at the red smoke you can see in the distance which is at waypoint B2 now the RB05A has a range of about 9 kilometers um, I wouldn't recommend f launching it anything higher than that because LC will just make it more difficult guiding it and uh, you also want to have the RB05A controls mapped to your joystick and in the real vegan uh, this uh, device down here is the joystick used for the RB05A but uh, you can either use your joystick and use a toggle button or like I did map it to some uh, to a head switch or something like that now for actually engaging we want to go ahead and we want to go into a small descent just towards the target I was enabling the attitude hold. Now we want to put the safety off and then we want to fire the missile. Uh, if you turn the safety off, you only have about 40 seconds to fire the missile, else its battery will run empty. So if you don't fire it within 40 seconds of the safety off, uh, the missile will go in up or will not launch. Okay, and now we'll just guide the bright dot onto the target. Oh, sorry, putting a bit down and we should have impact soon. And uh, there we go hit the roof of the target building uh, the high explosive amount uh, killed the building now hitting a building is quite easy and uh, but I guess to hit a tank or anything that size uh, will take a lot of practice and uh, as usual I will upload this mission and I will have the link for it in the description and uh, next to this target I will also place a second smoke marker a green one or a yellow one or whatever with a tank beneath it so you can use the same mission to either try to engage a building or try to engage a tank so yeah thank you very much for watching i hope you could learn something uh, i mean this video was quite short straightforward there's not too much to talk because uh, the rb05a is just all about the practice but once you manage that you might be getting much better than me or at least that's what i would hope for you so yeah thank you very much for watching and fly safe see you in the next one